Dear Sarah, we're finally here. If you asked me five years ago if I would have guessed that I would be marrying my best friend, I never would have guessed that I would be standing in front of you here today. If you asked me five years ago, I don't think I could have imagined how amazing it would be standing here with the most brilliant, beautiful, caring woman that I know. But here we are, babe. We are at the beginning of the rest of our lives, and I can't wait to see what God has in store for us. I love you, babe, and I can't wait to spend the rest of our lives together. First and foremost, I love you and choose you like Pikachu. Just kidding. On the Pikachu part. <laughs> but I really do love you and choose you. I promise to worship with you and write heavenly songs with you. I promise to support you in going after your dreams just as you have supported me. I am so blessed and thankful to God that I get to have you as my husband to cherish and to hold all day and always and forever. If you asked me five years ago if I thought that I would one day be saying my vows to Sarah Clarissa Sunarzo, I would have told you, you're crazy. <laughs> I'm so grateful to have found someone that is chasing God at the same speed and intensity as I am. I can't say I can promise you everything or even the world, but here's what I can promise. I promise to put the things that matter most, like God, family, friends, and others, before the things that don't matter as much, like, I promise to keep your heart and guard it too. I promise to always love you, even in times where we really don't like each other. <laughs> I promise to always sing with you. I promise to grow as old and as wrinkly with you as I possibly can. I love you, babe, and I can't wait to spend the rest of our lives together. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure and honor to present you for the very first time the newlywed couple, Mr. and Mrs. Matthew and Sarah Kwa.